Hello and welcome back to the Vengeful Farmer. We're here at Catilla's farm. Catilla farm. And uh, I want to put my ebony sword on. Yeah. So I've been thinking, I looked at the, I've been looking over views and stuff like that for videos. While we're talking, why don't we just head on up to uh, Solitude and try to catch a boat. Oh wait, no, the boats are down here. Ha! So I've been thinking, and I looked over the views, um, I want a bit of input from everybody. What length does everybody like? I know that, see, 15 minutes, way too short for me. 25 to 30 is pretty optimal for, um, I just wanted to discover that. Pretty optimal for me for rendering out and then getting them ready. I thought I heard nerd for getting them ready to um, upload and, and just render. But um, I've noticed I get, I get a good like 10 to 20% more views on the videos that are like 45 minutes to an hour, right? So I'm just wondering if that's something you guys want to see. So right now, just let me know in the comments so that none of us forget. Isn't Serana supposed to be here? And then, um, yeah, just let, me know, let me know in the comments what you think. Lead Serana to her home. Hmm. And then um, I, I'll, I'll start recording like that, I think. It's quite a bit longer for me to render if it's 45 minutes to an hour, but I'm willing. Let's see. I'd like to hire a boat. Um, Dawnstar Windhelm. Okay, cool. I can I can switch between those. Island near the border of High Rock. The one with the ruined castle. Don't you know that place is cursed? I don't care. Even seasoned sailors steer far around that place. Ah, you weakling. I need to go there anyway. As far as I can, but I'm not hanging around, and it's going to cost you extra. Whatever. Five hundred. Take me to the, take me near the castle to the west. Climb on in and let's get this over with. Cry, baby. Serana, you here? For real? Should we wait an hour? Let's just wait an hour. No? I'm kind of surprised, to be honest. Looking to hire a boat? Yeah, I already hired you. Oh, that made me kind of cold. Let's get out of here. I'm sure she'll show up. <laughs> Yeah, she'll show up. She knows the way. It's a crazy looking staff. So I did just get back from uh, holiday from 4th of July. Went up to... Well look, I've got both of them here. Good. Tekrid and Serana. You gonna um, say something smart? This is the part where we usually get in the boat. Yeah. Are you, you with me? She's kind of smart. Like I don't really like her. Let's go to Castle Volcari. Volcar? Volcar, right? Just got back from uh, spending some time actually up in Idaho, and it was super beautiful up there. It actually reminded me of Skyrim. I went on a hike to a really cold lake, and uh, it, it really reminded me of Skyrim. So that was kind of cool. I took a bunch of pictures. I didn't really take any video, which is probably a missed opportunity there, but um, I might share those on the channel. I'm not sure how interested anybody would be. Take a look at that, but it was pretty pretty cool looking. Is Dawn? Dawn Guard doesn't glow. I should get that mod. Okay. What is it? Alright. I think. I know your I friends think. would probably want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. Lord Harkin's a great man. Best show him the proper respect. Okay. Let's just take off the, um armor while we're going in here. <coughs> Man, excuse me. That's... Ugh, I hate doing that. I need to get some water. Usually I have some water sitting around. There we go. Get a little horse. So yeah, let's see what happens inside this castle. I mean, they're all obviously vampires if she's been stuck in that tomb forever, so... Loading. How dare you trespass here? Wait, Serana? Is that truly? Yeah, you're definitely a vampire. I cannot believe my eyes. 
It's kind of cool looking, actually. Hmm. Spiked mace. My lord, everyone! Serana has returned. I guess I'm expected. I can't believe it. Hmm. Are you gonna go down? Let's see. My long lost daughter returns at last. The dramatic I slow walk. Have my elder scroll. After all these years, that's the first thing you ask me. Oh yes, boy. Of she has the scroll. This can't be good. You, Vampire cattle? Must I really say the words oh boy. Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Now tell me, who is this stranger you have brought into our hall? This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? <sighs> hmm. You first. Very well. I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter will have told you what we are. Yeah, you're vampires. <laughs> A reclusive cannibal cult. Um... Not just vampires. We are among the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim. For centuries, we lived here far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. Uh, what happens now? I... this... that's such a silly thing. Do I get a reward? No, like, what happens now? I'm you have a done me clan of vampires. Service, and now you must be rewarded. There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. I offer you my blood. I'm sorry. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach and you will never fear death again. And if I refuse your gift? Then you will be prey, like all mortals. I will spare your life this once, but you will be banished from this hall. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! This is oh. the power that I offer. Now, make your choice. Interesting. Alright, guys. Um, what should I do? Oh! oh but what should I do? Should I accept his gift? Um... don't want to become a vampire fuse your gift or I'll accept your gift to become a vampire. What should we do? Um, I'm thinking I don't want to become a vampire. So yeah. be it. You are prey, like all mortals. I banish you. Oh dear. Okay, so he didn't kill me, I think. Yeah, I don't want to become a vampire. It's a curse. I've had plenty of problems with curses and Daedric lords and princes. I don't need more issues. Okay, so he threw me out, and there's my there's my trusty Nord companion. Let's go ahead and suit up. Now I can actually move. Um, he just kicked us out. Like rude. Is there anything in here we should take a look at? It's kind of hard to see in here. Let's see. Here we go. Wow, like this area up here is just really gray. I wonder if that's an issue with the mod, but it, it doesn't quite seem like it is. Alright, well there's nothing up here. Just looking at the castle. Hmm. Well, um... We've lost Serana. Should we try to get her back? Let's get some of these. Anything? Hey, hey, gargoyle. <laughs> Let's see. No? Okay, well. 
Um, what's our journal say? We need to speak with Isran. Don't think he's going to be that happy that we lost Irana, but maybe he is, because he didn't like her that much anyway. Let's go tell him. Whatever. Whatever. So where did this boat take us? It took us to Icewater Jetty. Oh wow, all the way from over there. So we have to walk all the way out of there? Jeez! And going back to Isran is way, way, way down here. I should get a map mod, shouldn't I? I'm just thinking about that. Just change it up, make it look a little different. There's a wolf. Oh good. Sky's clear. Wonder if I'm really cold. It should tell me here in a second. Come on. Oh! Yeah, get out of here. Sword is pretty darn strong. Let's see. Where'd it go? Ebony? Yeah, Ebony Sword. Wait, that should not be number one anymore. Dawnbreaker should be number one. There we go. Numero uno. Have I talked to these guys? I guess I haven't. Let's see. What is this place? That's privileged information. Now, move along. Are you guys vampires too? No. Just high elves. What do you think the folks back in I do hope you know what you're doing with those flames. I'll bet you ten gold pieces cut on the shame if something caught fire. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, these guys aren't really bothering us. They just want me to leave. Alright, you know what? That's fine. Whatever. I don't need to mess with that place. Which way is up? Hmm. I always kind of get lost around here. I definitely don't need the light anymore. Well, I think what we'll need to do is get back to solitude. I mean, I don't... I think I've looked at that before. It doesn't really work. I think I need to head up this direction. So we'll head along the coast. Go here. Um, we'll say hey to Myrda with her sword. But uh, maybe... See, Dragon Ridge doesn't have a stable, but the... Cat too Ketla's farm does. So maybe we will... Oh, watch out for these guys. Maybe we'll take a carriage ride from there. So... Steve Burrow. Um... Should we check it out? Nah. Nah. I'm actually pretty eager to continue the Dawn Guard quests. So let's keep uh, let's keep going. By the way, I think you know I've, I've talked about before that I don't like to fast travel. I think I want to um, I think I want to enlist a new rule. I've thought about this. Uh, first of all, these guys are going down because they're bandits. Oh great, wolves and stuff. Oh, that did not feel good. Holy crap! Get her! Okay. She, oh, that was a big hit. That was a big hit. Woo! That wolf kind of saved my life there a little bit. Got her. Okay. Oh yeah, power attack. Power attack. Bandit conjurer adept. Anybody else? Man, they hit hard. Jeez. Let's take a look and see what they've got. Oh, that's friggin' cool armor. Oh. Look at that. Dwarven Mage Unarmored Boots. Gauntlets. This must be a new mod. Look at how cool that is. Holy crap. Thank you. Summons an Avenging Wraith for 30 seconds. Stats are equal to 150% of the opponent that last killed it. Huh. Interesting. I want to check out that armor here in a little bit. Let's, uh, let's loot and just see what's going on here. Adept? Yeah, we could probably get this. Oh! oh dang it. Come on. Come on. So, I, I was saying that... Um, I don't know if I even said that, because we just started getting into the fight. I think I want to enact a new rule that I should be able to fast travel once a day. It's like a magic spell that I can only use once, and it has to cool down. Um, I don't need those things... What? Conjures. Let's see. Summons another lich 
for 180 seconds and inflicts damage, damaging disease, lowers skill levels, and raises the dead. We gotta see that in action. What the heck is that? Okay, whatever. That's food and crap. Anything over here? What, what is this? Oh, salmon. Okay. Man, that boat got jacked. Look at all that debris. Nordmead. Don't want that. Anybody else? Where did the guys go that died? Let's zoom out. Okay, here. So we've got Bandit, Outlaw, Mage, Unarmored Gauntlets, Dwarven Ones. We already have those. I'm not going to pick those up again. But those look like Leather and Dwarven Gauntlets combined. That's really cool. I like that. Um, primitive Nord Heavy Caress. Primitive. Looks pretty cool to me. I'm not going to pick it up. I, don't, I can't carry it, and it's not that good, but... I'm liking the, uh, liking the different looks. Wait, that's a heavy plate. Which plate? What is that? Steel, steel plate. Yeah, that's all good stuff. That's actually really good armor. Um, oh, we are, we're getting cold. Let's stand by the fire, see if we can warm up. Okay, and I'll check out, let's check out this helm real quick. Which plate? Still got that steel plate thing. <laughs> I wonder if I should... I need something that's a hood. That's right. Okay. I always forget. Now this dwarven thing works. Um, this does not. That's less armor. But does it remove... This thing. Actually, one second. Okay, let's see if it took off the... Oh, it didn't take off the Ethereum crown. I don't know how well that matches. Let's just put that on for a while. Let's just see what it looks like. Alright. Um, I think that's everything. That was warming me up a little bit. Oh, man, darn it. We should just stay, huh? Let's just stay. We'll let the orb run out. Let it warm up. I have noticed it since I put on the uh, fur hood thing. That. The fur. Keeps me warmer. So yeah, fast travel once a day. I think that's fair enough, right? Because we... We don't... We don't stop that much, we just keep going. So it'll only be fast traveling maybe once every couple episodes. So that probably wouldn't be too bad. So once this orb runs out, maybe we'll do that. Yeah, I think we're going to. So let's go to map. But I think we should have a limit to how far we can fast travel, right? Like, like I think I should just fast travel to hit the stable. I think that's fair. So I'll do that. Let's just fast travel once a day. It looks like it's Sunday. All right. So tomorrow, I'll be able to do it again. Almost like a hearthstone or something that you can use every once in a while. See, I don't fast travel much, so the game's like, What are you doing? Alright, here we go. Trouble. No. Should I be concerned? I am colder now. Oh, that's my healing spell. Okay. I wish there was a way to uh, equip your secondary weapon without going in and out of stuff. Which, oh wait. I can summon these things, right? This Dwemer deal? Oh, I can! Oh my gosh, I should totally be using that. I'm a dingbat. I'm gonna start using that now. Um, let's see. We need to head to Riften. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Um... Riften. Perfect. Now, some of you might say that it's kind of like I fast traveled twice, right? Not really. I'm using money. So, it's in game. We still have the fast traveling, right? But I think the biggest trouble is if I fast travel to a cold place, I'm going to start getting cold too quickly, and it could really hurt me. I've, I have fast traveled before and been frigidly cold and not been able to warm up fast enough and died kind of funny, because I didn't fast travel to a city, I fast traveled just to a location, and uh, Too lazy to walk, eh? that didn't work. Well, yeah! Found the right place. <laughs> Dude, he's dropping! <laughs> he knew exactly what we were talking about. I don't know, I kind of, kind of like the hood. Every day I, fight with the I don't think I want to go through Riften, um, let's just, let's just head out. I like running with my sword out for some reason. Of course, I'm going to poke my eye out if I do that. My mother would not be happy. Big jump. Big jump. Yeah, that's going to hurt. 
Do I have the dwarven homunculi I think? Yeah, okay. Let's just summon that and get it ready. So we might need it. It just follows, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, and there's our uh, Nord companion as well. Hey, who are you? That's close in. You picked a bad time to get Oh! Friend. Let's just see how they do. Let's see how they do. Come on, get him. Let's see. Does he hit hard? Oh, he does. Let's see if he'll take down my summon guy. Why was I hearing heartbeats? What was that? Get him! Oh! What? Fugitive? What is going? I'm in the middle of a fight. Slow down, fool! Excuse you? Wait, wait! I can talk to him. I'm really confused as to what the heck's going on. It's a fugitive. That's a guy that attacked us. We may have provoked him a little. Let's just take a look in the chest here. That was weird. Oh, see, now I remember why I didn't use the homunculi thing, because I have 90% reduction in magicka regeneration, so it's not coming back that quick. I'm carrying too much to run. What am I carrying? I'm not going to use that. Uh, not going to use that. Uh, I'm really not going to use these, but I should probably just sell those. Just keep my money up a little bit. Alright, there we go. Okay. To the Dawn Guard. So yeah, that summon guy actually does quite a bit of Damage. What the? Who are you? Oh, that's. That's her girl. What is going on? Man! Get out of here. Oh, jeez. Stupid fugitive. He didn't have anything good on him anyway. Alright. What? Gosh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, he went that way. Thanks. Bastard stole from me. Oh, you I'll look cool, him. buddy. Look at him. That's a cool armor, dude. Don't go set on fire, okay? Everybody's so worried about my sword. Oh, gosh. Someone in the distance is playing with a toy. Don't know if you can hear it. It's kind of ridiculous. Oh, jeez. All right, let's head back in here. Day Spring Canyon. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know how well you guys can hear that. It's kind of funny. All right. Well, let's get back to the castle, and then I think we'll end it there because the next one we'll have to we'll have to report to Isran that um, that Serana has a vampire family and she's gone, which I don't think he'll be too concerned about because he didn't really like her to begin with, so. Let's just mushroom, mushroom. Oh wait, no! Oh, mushrooms. Um, I forgot. We hate mushrooms. Okay. Ugh. Yuck! Cannot be carrying mushrooms on us. That is a negative Ghost Rider. All right, let's see. Oh! Who are these guys? Oh! Oh, you hit hard. Holy crap. Oh, look at that. That's what I thought. Get him! Yeah! Two down. One to go. Oh, we got him. We got him. Okay. Let me heal. That was some good fight there. Isron, dude. Um, I need that spell. Ring mail? That's pretty cool. And then we've got one other guy over here. Where did he go? Nope. Alright, well, this run looks pretty cool. 
We'll talk to him next time. Thanks everybody for joining and leave in the comments about the link in the video, what you're thinking, and yeah, we'll kind of adjust based on that. So I'll see you guys next time. Later.